We know that multiples of a number are the product of that number and another whole number. Common multiples are those which two or more numbers share. When we're looking at common multiples, we're frequently finding the least common multiple, which is the first multiple that two or more numbers share. So we want to find the least common multiple of 8 and 12. We're going to start by listing out our multiples of 8 and our multiples of 12. Multiples of 8 include 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72, and 80. Now we know they go on from there, but that should give us enough to have something in common with 12. Listing out multiples of 12, we have 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96, 108, and 120. Again, we know they go on from there, but we should have something in common with 8 by now. If we look, 24 appears on both the list for 8 and 12, as does 48, and so does 72. So 24, 48, and 72 would all be common multiples. But we're specifically looking for the least common multiple, which would be the smallest, or the first one they have in common, which is 24. So that tells us the least common multiple of 8 and 12 is going to be 24. We can also find the least common multiple of more than two values. Here we want to find the least common multiple of 12, 30, and 40. So we'll start out by listing our multiples of 12 again. 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96, 108, and 120. Those are our first 10 multiples, so hopefully that'll be enough to have something in common with 30 and 40. Listing out the first 10 multiples of 30, we have 30, 60, 90, 120, 150, 180, 210, 240, 270, and 300 will be our 10th multiple. We'll do the same for 40 and list out its first 10 multiples. 40, 80, 120, 160, 200, 240, 280, 320, 360, and our 10th one will be 400. From here, we can start looking at ones they have in common. Well, if we go down our list of 12, we can see that 60 appears on our list of 12 and 30, but it doesn't appear on our list for 40. So it's not going to be the least common multiple of 12, 30, and 40, since it doesn't appear on all three lists. If we keep going, we come to 120. We see 120 appears on our list for 12, 120 appears on our list for 30, and 120 appears on our list for 40. So since that's the first multiple that all three values have in common, it's our least common multiple. So the least common multiple of 12, 30, and 40 is 120. Check out the other videos in our playlist and don't forget to click on subscribe. Thanks for watching.